I forgot today we are getting our first smug village in the campsite. Oh, I'm nervous. We're not gonna be able to pick whether this this one this guy moves in this guy imagine calling villagers guys i didn't play yesterday so i'm not sure what's in me mail um <gasps> a mum item oh you know how i feel about the mum items they're my favorite they're all so cute let's sleep more snuggles how about more sleep more snuggles thoughts <gasps> a plushie Oh, <laughs> that, that is so cute. That is so, so cute. I am definitely going to be keeping that. I've never actually received one of those myself. Like, I think I've been given them a couple times for like manifesting stitches and all. An exercise bike. What's Maddie trying to say? Girl, you saying I need some exercise? I'd be running all over my island every day, okay? Just... I... And a punching bag! Oh, wow! Thank you, Happy Home Academy. That's just... That's just great. And, as you can see, my house has been upgraded yet again, so I've lost all of our shrubberies, which is fine. I'm fine. I'm not fine. I'm very upset. I miss my shrubs already. Oh no. Now I'm going to have to move my freezer. <laughs> Unbelievable rudeness, honestly. All right, let's register this new song. Do I have any items that I want to go in here? I kind of feel like maybe this should be my exercise room. People be out here listening to pop music when they're working out. But we have this vibe for our exercise room. It's a, it's a sophisticated exercise room. And when I say exercise room, I mean gym, because that's what they're called. Perfect. Actually, you know what? I like to look out the window if I'm if I'm gonna be cycling. Out the window. Yeah. Can I get on it? No, that would be too much to ask. You're right. <laughs> All right, well, this is our new room. <laughs> Surely we have some items to put in here, right? Can, oh, this can't fit, can it? Can't. Oh, surely. What? Oh my gosh. Wait, you can make, you can make your own museum in your house. I could put my podium in here and then I'll put I'll put that like over there and then up on the wall we can put a piece of art. Look at that. Imagine if you get Raymond. Oh my god, stop. Stop it. Stop it. I can't. I'll put this one here and then we can put the Mona Lisa we can make a rival museum to blathers. Is that BM? I feel like that's so mean. <laughs> <laughs> Which is all the more reason why I want to do it. Okay, don't don't mind me. Don't mind me. Just just doing a cheeky bit of interior design here. Oh, that's larger than I thought it was gonna be. This one. Oh, perfect. And then I can put a floor light down as well. Oh, it's perfect. I love it. I love it. <laughs> it looks awful. <laughs> and then, oh, we can put this in here as well. <gasps> My own personal museum. I wish you could invite your villagers in. Blathers would be so upset with me. Alrighty, so I guess we should go and check out who our smug villager is. Wait, where did I put the campsite again? I take one day off and I'm like completely, con I'm so confused about where everything is. Oh. What? 
first day there she says there's an announcement there and the next day there's a villager. Oh, Do we time travel? Do you remember who you got last time? Yeah, I got Lucha last time. I'm not like mad about it, but I'm I'm also not happy. He was sick for like <laughs> two weeks or something, and he was like, "Listen, you you gotta bring me some medicine. I'm dying here." And I was like, "Nope, sorry." Oh, wow, savage. Yeah, I was kind of an asshole. He wasn't that bad. He was always really nice. And the other leg. Oh god. See, so, like you can play Switch and be active. Wait, did I tell you guys about- Oh my god, guys. You're gonna have such a laugh at me. I can't remember whether I said this on stream or whether I just told Julia about this, but I feel like I might have said this on stream. When I first started playing Animal Crossing, I had a job, so I'd work during the day. I normal normally would like exercise in the evenings when I would normally play Animal Crossing, but I'd play so much of this game when I first got it that I never had any time to do any exercise. So in the end, what I started doing was just marching on the spot while playing Animal Crossing. All right, uh, yeah. Hey, listen, okay, I never said I wasn't gonna cheat at this time around. I just said I wasn't gonna terraform, okay? Cheating, ch cheating's allowed. <laughs> we can cheat all we want. Oh god, I'm nervous. <gasps> it's Lopez! Oh my god, this is definitely the best possible villager, smug villager we could have gotten. Okay, wait, hold on. Who who are the Oh yeah, we were hoping for Julian. But Lopez. This boy has pink eyeliner like hello. Oh I'm pretty good at I'm pretty good at reading people. I also love the colour of his fur. Like the blue and the orange and the cream. It's so like I wanna say 70s. I can even tell that you're really gonna enjoy having me here. Oh, he's one of those smugs. Okay. I don't know. Maybe I'm just imagining things, but I feel like everyone wants me to move here. It's just the vibe, you know? Like, when you can tell you're gonna be part, you're gonna get the part in a car commercial. <laughs> yeah, I totally know the feeling. Yeah. Why do I feel like smug villagers are my drunk personality? Wow, I'm honored. An exclusive invitation to an exclusive island for celebrities and entourages. Wow, you and Maddie both, huh? Why is he like a peppy? There's just only one little thing. I'd hate for it to be so exclusive that it's just me. <laughs> Can you go check in with like the VIP manager of the whole island first just so I know this is legit? Bitch, it's me. I'm the VIP manager. What do you, what do you mean? What, did I say Guten Tag? Hello? My fate is in your hands. Ha ha. Ha ha. Okay, okay, okay. Wow, this is amazing. The VIP manager? Bitch, I am the VIP manager. Why do you think I'm here? It doesn't not show by my, my jumpsuit I have on. I guess we'll go and talk to Tom Nook. Why am I like bitter about the fact that he's referring to Tom and not to me? Now, Izzy B, since you closed the deal with our visitor, you should be the one to pick the location for a new home. I'm busy right now. Leave it to me, bitch. I'm the VIP manager. Oh, good morning, Norma. How are you? A very good morning to you, Izzy B. Hoof hoo. I didn't make it cute, but it's cute when she does it, I'm sure. I just want to say that I really appreciate you stopping by on my first day here to say hello. <gasps> You're welcome. I finally finished unpacking and I'm freed up to chat and hang out anytime. Oh, before I forget, I'm glad I ran into you because I have a little something for you. A hello gift for my new neighbor. Oi! She's giving me a gift. Something popular from where I'm from. A nail art set. Wow, thank you, Norma. 
Guess I'm from here now though. <laughs> I need to get used to saying that. Girl, where did you come from? Like a nail salon? Where should we put Lopez's house? Uh, we've got like the two ladies over here and I kind of like that there's just two of them. I was thinking one could go here, but um, I feel like the, the walkway from the airport to the, uh, the resident services it's like it's a nice it's nice like it's nice having space in the front here this could be a little park area and what's more I actually have a bridge here now so he could go over here although this is quite a narrow spot isn't it like this is definitely awkward spacing a thick striped shirt Ooh, spicy. I know exactly who I'm gonna give that to. <laughs> the lucky boy Bill for all who gets all of the re-gifts. How have you been, Quacko? So good. I just be receiving gifts left and right that I know you'd love. Actually, I I do really want to see him in this. Wait, he likes it! This should really help me highlight my delts. Oh my god, it's perfect. Like, it sounds like I'm being really mean that he's getting all my re-gifts, but like, they all look really good on him. Like, everything does. I guess while we're here and we're giving gifts, we may as well... Oh, Charlize isn't here? Oh, she, she's in her house. Great. I desperately want to fill up her house with more cool stuff because it's so like awkwardly empty. So we've got we've got stuff for her. Oh my god, the green theme. It's taking form. <laughs> um why is Charlize always crafting? Like, girl, got a groove going now. This is starting to rock. Ugh. Hey, what am I doing? A shell partition! So I, <laughs> when I did the customization workshop, I decided to customize this um, wardrobe into a green color. And oh, we're not gonna see it now, but it's gonna look really good in our house. Just trust me. It's like a br like bright green, like it is all the green. So a blue dot flooring. Wow, thank you. I, that's gonna be perfect in my museum. Uh, I guess we'll check real quickly what this looks like. It somehow softens the room a little bit. Um, I'll stick with the gold <laughs> for now. <laughs> for now. <laughs> Should I put this place item? Yeah, that, that kind of fits kind of like notes on my art in my art room it's my art room I just realized I got totally distracted we were trying to find a place for Lopez's house and now I am I am I'm I'm not doing that hi it's me Tucker uh, I actually have an item that I want to give him so I'm gonna go and grab it all right I have a special little bug cage for you we meet again do I give him a top? I'm kind of sick of seeing him in like the leopard print toga. Hmm. Yeah, let's give him the camo tee. Oh no, what if it looks really bad? A camo tee? This is a really great, my other clothes are kind of crusty. Ew. What are you doing to your, oh. Wow. You look great. <laughs> Wow, I'm kind of an asshole. What? Oh man, I really don't know where to put his house. I don't think I should put him next to Tucker's house. I think Lopez would probably be offended by Tucker's crusty clothing. Um, I could put him like over here, but there's no way he can get out, which is like kind of awkward. Wait, let's take a look at his house really quickly. This is what his house looks like. It actually looks really similar to Tucker's. Can I see the interior as well? Oh, damn. That, that is a very, very fancy house. I mean, this could be kind of a cute place. He gets worn out of his little island so he won't be stuck all the time. Oh, can he? Okay, cool. Well, let's put him over here. He can have his own private little island. You know who's gonna be jealous? Maddie. Maddie's gonna be jealous. 
This is gonna be cute. We can have a little sitting area next to the water. It doesn't show it built. I hate that. It's a shame that I can't set up a bridge today. Cause I, I it would be nice to be able to actually get to his house like easily. Oh, there's a bug. <laughs> How am I so excited about bugs now? There's just something about like the fact that these stumps exist that makes me very upset. So seeing bugs on them is great. A jewel beetle. I've never seen this before. How many hours and we've never seen that bug before. Look at it. It's so pretty. Wow, it's like super common. Wait, she's wearing the little leopard print top I gave her. Haha. <laughs> Wait, did I give it to her? No, I didn't. Wait, Bill gave it to her. Wow. <laughs> he really knows her style. Good morning, Mabel. Thanks for stopping by. How can I help today? What is on sale? If it's anything like a... Uh, ooh! <gasps> headband? That's cute. Yeah, I want it. That's perfect. I like also these pajama pants. Actually, literally, everything that Mabel is selling today, I want it. Except for maybe that long skirt. I've got one long skirt, the purple one, and that's all we need. That's most normal looking Peppy I've ever seen. She does look very normal. I feel like Maddie looks like a normal villager, but she has the personality personality of like three peppies put together. Honestly, like Mabel, you've outdone yourself. These are these are really mm, delicious clothing. Could eat, would eat, might eat. Who knows? Depends on how hungry I am. Um. Oh, hello. Is he B? I'm right here. <laughs> he was like, I ran like two meters. You think I'm gonna run more? No, I'm not. Have you been using <gasps> reactions? More reactions? <laughs> Oi, I love this reaction. Thank you, Taka. I love it. We got bashful. All right, let's see what's in the butt crack today. I should make a custom sign that says butt crack in the nooks cranny like typography. <laughs> Thoughts? <laughs> Alright, do I want any of these items? No. No, I do not. But I do want money from you guys for selling things. You know, in ethical ethical ways. Uh, headband. Layered tank dress. I'm gonna sell this. Uh, yes, I want that pant. The pants? Um, yeah, that's everything. Cool. Uh, okay. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, no. Oh, God, no. Not the rubber flooring. We know how I feel about that. Okay, these seem like a lot for my house. You know, what would be nice, though? It would be nice to give the pink painted wood wall to Julia. She's given us so many fantastic wallpapers and flooring. I feel like we should be reciprocating, you know? We went for a very, um, you know, I, I would say that this is a garish card. So let's go for something a little more subtle this time. Subtle, but also um, romantic. Uh, oh, these are just boring though. This one's cute. I like the shapes card. It's not very romantic. We can probably do something about that though. Is that romantic enough? <laughs> Pink painted wood wall. He's a balloon. An underwater wall? <gasps> this is perfect. Oh, I want this. Please don't tell me it uses fish to make it. That will make me very upset. <gasps> it's so cool. Summer shells and coral. We have to make this. This is awesome. Oh, a butterfly I don't have. Wait, what? Oh, there it is. Oh, it's quick. Can you customize the underwater wall? No, you can't, can you? There's like a little icon if you can. Okay. Oh, 
Whoa. Whoa. I thought they were gonna be real fish. I'm not gonna lie. I was I was pretty excited. Let's get our shell partition. Oh, I like it. Alrighty, well, we have our first smug villager. I now need to time travel back in time, but that's fine. We have him, he's moving in. So if I move back in time, hopefully that shouldn't mess it up. I don't I don't think it should. 